Imagine if you could escape reality into a place where you could be anywhere, go anywhere, and make anything. Sounds unreal, right? Well, let me introduce you to Anyland. Or rather, let these four inhabitants introduce you themselves. My name is Ben. Graf Savage. I am Coral Master. I come from Aptra Science Innovators. Hello, I'm Sleeves. An Anyland player. I'm a beautiful crayon man. I came to this game room right now, Anyland, when I was 14 years old. This is when I made this avatar, and a lot of people in this game, this a little community, everyone makes their first avatar, and it's always really ugly. Over time, people get better and better at building things, and their avatars get more interesting. But this is my original chest piece. Yeah, people get real fancy avatars as you come along. But that's the most of it to me. Um, I was just looking through free VR games on Steam. I think I found it on Steam. Searching through like Steam games, I was trying to find a multiplayer VR game. I met some friends who uh, asked me if I wanted to play Rec Room, but on steroids, and I said yes, that would be a lot of fun. I, I need to make an egg gun. Oh god, you already went ahead before me. Oh. What brought you to really start spending your time in A Land? Uh, it's mainly the people and just the stuff you can do in it. I've met lots of nice people, lots of not nice people. And, uh, you know, it's just really nice to be able to collaborate on projects and just sit and work on stuff like your avatar, for example, or an area and just have people there. It's always nice immense way that you can create anything like I create these arms I create this coffee cup that I can actually drink I create the avatar this whole place behind me there's something about building while talking to people that lets you illustrate what you're saying really well and also the creativity it was a very small community a very very small community and everyone knew each other <laughs> you could build any sort of world in an hour so every time I get into the game, I just, it's just so cool. Well, we're always looking for more, and VR can kind of give us literally anything. So once the technology gets better, I think we'll be spending a lot more time in VR. I think it impacts the world a lot better than it was before, because, uh, you know, you can connect to games like this and have such an amazing experience uh, with people from all around the world and stuff and uh, just do whatever you want, essentially. But at the same time, restrictions are kind of what make things interesting. So sometimes being able to build anything makes what you do build a little bit less exciting. Well, first of all, uh, if you haven't played VR, I very, very much recommend it. Two, if you uh, if you get VR and you play games, get Anyland is very fun. And three, I remember there was a long time ago I talked to someone about this. Something about AR, AR and VR are kind of very closely entwined in like, their place in the future. And I have no doubt VR is going to be used for training people. Specifically that, I know that's going to be its most popular thing in the future. I'm not sure why, I'm just pretty sure of it. You should show them how you look. You should let them see that.
Bye. Bye. Ha <laughs> <laughs>